Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome to Groovy's Garage. I appreciate you tuning in. Today, we're just gonna have a short video here checking out the high clearance cut on our factory front bumper here on the 2022 Toyota Tacoma TRD Sport. This cut applies to all your third generation Tacomas. And what I'm talking about is on your bumper right here and here, where the factory plastic comes down as well as the inner fender liner, which makes it a nice round curved body. That is now cut out, you can see on here. A lot of people refer to this as the Viper cut. Um, what this does is it does a couple things for us. One, it adds looks, that's always awesome. But two, what the most important thing is to me is it allows for a little bit more tire clearance. So larger tires, especially at a little bit of a flex and an angle while turning, you could have issues with rubbing your front plastic there, especially if your factory air dam, which runs under here on your third gens, if it is still on there from factory, that can sometimes be an issue with rubbing with larger tires, like I said, off-roading and all that. And then another thing that kind of helps out is it gives you just a tiny bit more ability for your approach angle. If you're coming up on an object, whether it's a rock or a hill or something, it gives you just a little bit more space up here that you can travel before hitting your bumper. So let's get up closer to it and look at the cuts. All right, so now we're up closer here and you can see where it was cut. So the factory bumper runs right around there and it comes up. So you can see how it was cut out. Uh, I did not do this one myself. I did the cuts on the front bumper. Uh, I actually had this down at 88 rotors. So I gotta give a shout out to them for putting on the King suspension. And they went ahead and did the cut for me while I was in there. Uh, rel relatively easy, you mark it off. You can honestly do it wherever you want. Follow the body lines or get a template, whatever you want. There's hundreds of videos out there on this one now. Uh, I just wanted to show you like a different look at it. So if you wanted to see a different angle. And once it's cut, you know, you're going to want to shave down the plastic a little bit and then put on the stripping. The stripping just kind of keeps that sealed, helps prevent the paint from flaking. So that is that on there. Let's go get one more look on the side. All right, so now here is a side view of it. You can definitely see where the factory has been removed. Uh, the normal one comes down to almost here and it goes around kind of flush. Um, like I said, you can see the extra clearance it gives you now. Uh, one thing to keep in mind, Normally right here, this piece would be more secure. The factory body that goes under there would be holding that place. However, I do have the body armor 4x4 bumper on here. So that does not allow it to stay there. However, the up the main bumper itself is still really secure. It's just this is a little flap here. That doesn't bother me. We uh, eventually will get our high clearance bumpers, uh, full plate bumpers rather for the front and that'll remove that whole thing anyway. So that is just a quick look here at that. If you have any questions, please put them down below. And thanks for tuning in to Groove's Garage. I hope you all have a fabulous day.